This video clip will show the improved feedback on delete and replace command. When you delete or replace attributes throughout your model, the dialog box now lists the number of elements and or attributes that will have missing attributes. Let's see it in detail. By activating the document, layers, layer settings menu command, the layer settings dialog appears. If you select one of the layers and click delete on the right, the delete and replace palette appears. Here you can choose the delete elements or the move elements onto option. If you select the delete elements radio button, all the elements of this layer will be deleted. If you select the move elements onto radio button, you can move the elements of the selected layer to another layer by choosing from the pop-up. After selecting the delete elements radio button, the details button will be activated in the bottom right corner of the dialog. Let's click it. The missing attributes palette appears. This list shows the number of elements or attributes that will result in missing attributes. Let's see another example. Select the options, element attributes, fill types menu command. The fill types dialog appears. Choose common brick from the list and click the delete button. The delete and replace palette appears. If you choose the delete and replace with option, it allows you to add another fill type. By choosing this option, all the elements which have included the common brick fill type will be replaced with a selected face brick fill. For example, this attribute will be replaced in composite structures, in profiles, or in favorites. If you select the delete option and click the details button, you'll get a feedback list about the various types showing the number of elements or attributes that will result in missing attributes.